OMG, it is snowing out. Can't even see it's so bright. Now you can. It's a snow day, so sexy soup time by Sara. Nothing sexier than cooking in your pajamas and your robe and your computer glasses. So I got a rotisserie chicken from Sam's Club. My thing's not working. All I did was throw it in there after I ate the chicken that I wanted yesterday, the leftover, I'm making soup out of it. So I added about four cups of water and I'm putting the heat on high. And now I'm going to cut up some celery and carrots. Don't use those little baby packaged carrots. Those are in some nasty juice. They don't taste fresh and good. Did I mention my uh, vegetables are organic? I just did, that matters. All right, so chop and drop time. It wasn't recording. So annoying. Okay, so I just dropped my celery in and I said, you know, there's nothing sexier than healthy. Yeah, and these are organic, so that's super healthy. All those minerals. And I am going to cook the chicken. Let me show you again. This is a Sam's Club chicken, a rotisserie. Okay, I'm going to cook this and let the broth get like basically really good and flavorful. See how it's changing color. And that's going to get all the nutrients from the bone marrow. Oh, what's the big thing now? Collagen. Yeah, this is how you're going to make your own collagen broth. It's crazy. There's, <laughs> this is going to be chicken stock. So yeah, I added celery, carrots, time to simmer. Mm. Is this recording now? Okay, so there's obviously, every time I'm making a soup, it can go a million different ways. That's what's so sexy about these soups. You don't have to be perfect, okay? Perfect isn't sexy. Anyway, no, we are human. So, um, every time it's a little different, and that's fine. So, that's what's kind of cool and creative about it. I was just thinking to myself, should I add beans to this? Like a can of chickpeas or anything, right? It's all up to you. So, I'm not really into the meat today. I'm really going to make this. I'm feeling stuffy and nasally because um, it's cold season. And as you know... We just traveled. Can you see the snow? It's a snow day. So the change in weather, I was just in Florida yesterday. And I'm so glad to be back in Ohio where we have the best produce. Oh my God. So flavorful, so full of nutrients. Yeah. Okay. I was like, should I put potatoes or macaroni? No, I could, but I don't even think I'm going to do beans right now. All right. So sexy broth is it? It is. And whatever, I think that's, I'm probably going to be the only one that eats this soup. Like, Chris probably isn't going to eat it. Zach's probably not going to eat it. None of my sisters are here to help me eat it. So, yeah, I'm just going to get the most out of this chicken and make a really good stock broth. I'm going to drink it to help the inflammation because collagen helps inflammation. That is true. Um, I wanted to show me cutting these. Like, this is a nice, good knife to cut the vegetables for. See? And then... You do them all at once. See? Isn't that nice? This is like basically my soup knife because it cuts vegetables so good. Um, and I also can use this to flatten and smash my garlic. So get yourself one of these and a good cutting board. This one says our last name. Suzlo, our perfect daughter, got it for us. <laughs> Love her. Okay, so time to chop, then drop them in the pot, y'all. All right. I'm going to add some, a little bit of garlic powder and parsley, and I'm not going to salt it till the very end. It might not need it because there was season on that skin from the chicken. All right, some, what, garlic powder, parsley, and a little cracked black pepper. Look at this big thing I get from Sam's Club. This is gar granulated garlic. This is not garlic salt. I don't use garlic salt because it's salt. My husband has... A heart condition um and it just makes me swell up as well <laughs> but yeah I don't want to kill him he can do that all on his own it's all what we eat and when your time's up your time's up so um, why not be sexy and healthy with my suits okay all right let's see where's the freaking parsley on it so I added garlic pepper and if I can't find the parsley, then I'm not going to add it, right? It's always the last place that you look, you know? Isn't that funny people say that? 
It's always the last place you look. Well, because if you found it, why would you keep looking? Uh, depends why you wait. Uh huh. It's meant to be. I did find some parsley. <laughs> All right. There it is. I added ground, uh, fresh ground black pepper, granulated garlic or garlic powder, and parsley flakes. By all means, if you have fresh parsley, use it. But don't, if you're like me, add just a little, this is how I like to do it. Um, do a little bit, somebody's di he's distracting me in my background, make me want to do work and stuff. No, cooking sexy soups. Okay, so what was I saying? Oh yeah, the parsley. If you have fresh parsley, don't add it all into your pot while it's cooking because it's gonna get wilted and stuff. Use those fresh herbs when you plate your bowl. Oh my God, and let it melt down. That just makes you feel like you're eating the most, like biggest bowl of yumminess. Like it's so fresh and it just makes you feel awesome inside and then you're putting that life right into you. So I love that. And if you're having a day where you're like, I need more than this, add some grated cheese, maybe some fresh cracked red pepper because that will spice it. Love it. I just gave that a stir in like a poke with my knife to break apart the chicken. It's just falling right apart. Looks great. Um, I'm going to add more water because this is definitely like it has some more flavor. I can probably add like um, another inch of water, a couple more cups. So that's what I'm going to do because I love, I love brothy soups. Back I only let this cook on like medium high for, I don't know, maybe an hour or two. Um, anyway, all of the meat fell off of the bone. And of course you can separate the skin and the bone. And I got out a bowl. Look how good it looks. There's only three ingredients. Carrots, celery, and the rotisserie chicken. So it's a great way to use the chicken from Sam's Club. It's already seasoned. I could have added onion. I could have added beans. I could have added pasta. I could do pasta on the side. Add it in as I serve it. Fresh parsley on top, all that stuff. So many different ways to do this, but I mean, this is it. This is good enough just how it is. Simple chicken soup. And why is it sexy? Because it's organic, healthy ingredients. Um, that broth is gonna help um, inflammation that's the big gimmick right now I mean it's not a gimmick it is a true fact but you don't have to buy collagen just eat some soups you know broth is sexy all right enjoy oh don't forget if you need more fat to this and you don't have your fresh herbs to put on top put a little sprinkle of grated cheese and maybe a little crushed red pepper I have those as staple items for every soup Oh, hell no, Kesha. Look at this. She wants it. That's not sexy. You want some chicken soup? You want some chicken soup? Oh, she gave me a hug. All right. And my cat likes it too. Oh, my cute kitty. My cute kitty. All right. Enjoy. What a pain in the butt. She doesn't even want soup. She just wants me to hold her. Say hi. Say hi. Oh, what a nice kitty. Oh, where were you when we were waiting for this to cook? Huh? And this is my third bowl of chicken soup. Made from rotisserie chicken from Sam's Club. And I added carrots and celery. That's it. Look how good it looks. And then I just seasoned it with some garlic powder, parsley, and pepper and salt. Easy. Just add water. Who would have thought that soups are mostly water? Oh, I just got that. Well, when they're sexy, they are.